Now let's double or nothing, let's find the new items. Oh, and there's one of them. Oh, he's got two of them. Hold on a second. That's, no, he's got... Th well, that's not fair. Okay, what do we have here? Adrenaline. Steal an item and use it immediately. Alright. I like that. Now, what's nice about this, uh, strategy-wise, is, for one thing, if he happens to have an adren... Okay, never mind. <laughs> I was kind of hoping it would let me steal his adrenaline and just... What the hell? There's a time limit? Hey! hey give me that... What the... Anyways, um, so you can't steal his adrenaline. That would have been cool if you could, because then you just get rid of all of his adrenaline. But, I guess I see why that's not allowed. Um, but what is nice about that item is not only are you getting another item pool to choose from, but also you can get rid of a dangerous item in his possession, like a handsaw, for example. Alright, your move, buddy. Oh, he's gonna st okay. Maybe I should have used the handcuffs so that he couldn't do that. That would have been smart. Okay, that's interesting. If he has adrenaline, on the other hand, you kind of have to use your items so that he doesn't steal them. And then again, he might just do that, so maybe it's not that big of a deal. So I like that. The adrenaline item already adds uh, quite a bit more depth to it. Kind of forcing you to use your items when the dealer has it. And, uh... Pretty useful when you have it. Alright, let's see what else we have here. Those other two new items? No idea. Well, here's one of them. Another adrenaline. Cool. Oh. Prescription only medicine. Keep out of reach of children. He has adrenaline, it looks like. Um, inverter. Swaps the polarity of the current shell in the chamber. Interesting. But I don't know what the current shell is in the chamber, so... Um, if I'm not mistaken, he just loaded, uh, one live and one blank. So if I use this, it's gonna change it to become either two blanks or two lives. The only thing is I won't know which. Now, of course, you could combo that with a magnifying glass. Uh, maybe I can steal his magnifying glass and, uh, then use the inverter if need be. I can also handcuff him, so it do if it does change a blank into a live, I can shoot him twice with that combo. And then we have expi <laughs> expired medicine. 40% chance to regain two charges, if not lose one charge. Okay, let's steal his magnifying glass. Alright, now I get to actually use this. Can't take this. We gotta go fast, because it does have an expiration. Oh, it's a blank. Perfect, perfect. In that case, this should change it to a live. Let's see if it worked. Now it should be two lives in there. Yep, we just changed a blank to a live. Um, interesting. You know, I might want to keep... The, here's a strategy, since this has a better chance of making him lose a charge. If this is the only item we have, and he uses that adrenaline, he might steal this, and then there's a good chance he just hurts himself. Could be a strat. I'm already seeing that there's a lot more strategy and depth added to it with these new items, so I'm very excited. Ah, there's our other new item. Alright, two blanks and one live. Burner phone. A mysterious voice gives you insight from the future. Let's see what it tells us. Third shell? Blank. Interesting. Now, if the second shell is blank, and we know that the other two shells in here is uh, one live and one blank, that means either the first or second shell is the only live in there. So if I handcuff him and we shoot him twice, he will get hit with that live shell. So let's do it. A lot of cool item combos now. Oh my goodness, this is awesome. Okay. Not a problem, because that means we know for sure now that this is a live round. Yep. Now he gets a turn, but all he has is a uh, blank round in there. Maybe I should have taken the uh, expired... Why are you punching that, sir? 
Oh, he just changed it on me. Wait, now it's a live round. Oh. Yeah, it's totally different, too, how he uses the items. Yeah, okay, he's gonna steal this. Hopefully it hurts him. <laughs> Rip bozo. Well, Mal. Okay, this is gonna hurt. One in one. I don't know if I want to invert that, but we could. Oh, beer's a bit better now. Let's get rid of whatever the first round is. Okay, so now it's just a blank in there, but I can change it to a live. And that means you're done, Mr. Dealer. I don't know about this expired medicine, dude. Um, in the rounds where there's only, like, two charges, isn't that kind of useless? Um, might as well use it, right? We'll see what happens. Oh. <laughs> whatever, whatever. Smoke it off, it's fine. Oh, he's using the phone. Yes, hello? Okay, <laughs> that's gonna... Okay, that's gonna change his behavior a bit, then. Ugh. Uh, gimme, gimme, gimme. Third shell live round. Well, let's hope the second one's a blank, then. Uh, uh, uh. Wait, third shell from now or from the start? That's a good question. I guess we'll see right now if this next shell is alive. He doesn't know that though, right? He doesn't know what this phone told me. Oh, clearly not. No, okay, so it's third from when you use the phone. Interesting. Oh, interesting. Yeah, there's definitely more blanks in there than lives right now. So he's trying to get a live round. Okay, so he went for the cigarettes instead of the expired medicine. Interesting. I mean, that makes sense, because he was only down one health. So this should probably hurt. Yeah. And now, we can use the expired medicine. Hope to, uh... Hope it works. Hope it's not too expired. Oh, another chance at the medicine. Nice. Okay, so if there's only two shells in the gun, then the phone is going to have to tell us what the second shell is, right? Unless it can tell you what the first one is. Okay, so... Yeah. I'm guessing it's never going to tell you what the first, or I should say next shell is, because that's kind of what magnifying glass does. I wonder what happens if there's only one shell left. Maybe it just won't let you use the phone? I don't know. But anyways, the second round is live, which means we want to do this. And now I can use the saw because we know that the only thing left is a live round. But first, let's see if uh, this works this time. Okay. Oh, oh, it did work. Whoa. Nice. Okay, that was cool. Oh, he's getting a call. Okay. Oh, perfect. So, I'll do this. Now there's nothing but a blank round in here. I'm guessing it's just not gonna let us use the phone? Oh, it'll let us use it. Interesting. Ah, never mind. Well, okay then. It lets you use it, but it doesn't actually even tell you what it is. <laughs> so you better pay attention. It's not going to save you if you forget what the last round is. Uh, we'll see if he uses the expired meds. He also has smokes, though, so... He went for the cigs. Interesting. Wait, he's using those too? What are you doing? What are you doing, dealer? He's crazy. <laughs> Rip Bozo. I guess it makes sense that he went for the SIGs first, because in the case that the expired doesn't work, that would have just ended him. So, makes sense. Let's see if the dealer is feeling lucky. 
Oh, he's going for it. Oh, perfect. And it does not go over the charge. Cool. All right. I think we know everything we need to. That's the new items. Um, just a showcase for now. I might make more of an in-depth uh, look at them and strategies and whatnot. But for now, that's the new stuff in Buckshot Roulette, and I'm very excited to play more of it. Let me know what you think in the comments, and uh, thanks for watching.